long-term effects of regular massage on mental health. So we've spoken in a couple of our other videos about how massage stimulates the brain into reducing dopamine, cortisol, so on and so forth, um, and changing the chemistry of your brain so that you feel better, you feel less pain, your mood's improved, so on and so forth. But I thought it might be quite interesting for you to have some a little bit of research here because massage has been shown to decrease cortisol levels, which is one of the key hormones in stress response, by as much as 30%. One session, 30% reduction. Awesome. Awesome. Plus, you're getting the benefits there of your muscles being released as well. So double whammy, mental, physical. Um, it increases activity in the parasympathetic nervous system, which is the one that is due for relaxing you, and it calms the body and the brain during stress. Over time, this can lead to reduced feelings of anxiety and improved resilience to stress. So not only are you dealing with the stress that you've got now, but your mental health in the future is going to be much improved because you've built up over time, over weekly, monthly, whatever your sessions are, you've built this up um, so that your body now can cope with the stress that's been thrown at it because you're starting from a lower base level. Does that make sense? So in terms of boosting mood and energy, massage prompts the release of endorphins, okay? The natural painkillers in the body. Um, and so that improves your mood and it boosts your energy levels because you're not in pain. So you've, you've got more energy to do other things with. It's not coping with the pain. Um, so it increases serotonin, it increases dopamine, neurotransmitters um, generally that are associated um, with pleasure.